Hello ladies and gentlemen, Holotide here, and what is 343 cooking up? We already know about the unannounced, announced, unannounced, announced, Tatanka, Certain Affinity, whatever that thing is going to be game mode, but this deals with 343 and what they're working on internally. That's not... Halo Infinite. Mr. Rebs tweeted something from a 343 product manager. He no longer works at 343. He actually left in January of this year, but said that Infinite had gained 30 million unique users as of January 2023. That number must have gotten to be a lot more because of season four and five, because a lot more people are playing. But within that tweet and within that post from that former product manager, we see that they were working on a unannounced internal project. Now, personally, I think that this is separate from the certain affinity game mode. Some people may say that it is. I honestly would not be surprised if that's like what it ends up being is, you know, internally they're working on this project in collaboration with certain affinity. But in that post from that product manager, the bullet point says, own the KPI, which is a key performance indicator for those who don't know, roadmap for an unannounced internal project leading to delivery of a mission critical flight readiness message in collaboration with multiple producers, designers, and engineers. It doesn't say anything about external entities or producers and stuff. So the wording makes me think, and there is a lot of, you know, business wording in that, it makes me feel like it is actually just a 343 thing. I'm sure if it was in a collaboration with another studio, that would be something to include in there that you want people to know that you can work, you know, across a wide variety of entities and help lead a project. So the fact that they did not say that makes me feel like it is internal. So what does that mean? What could this be? Is it campaign DLC? Is it a spinoff game? Could it be a unannounced thing within Halo Infinite? I think that's the least likely, but I feel like with how much we've seen Halo Infinite change and how the leadership is trying to not cater to the fan base, but do better by them. With how many people talk about Halo Reach and ODST and, you know, Jerome and Halo Wars, how many people want another spinoff game? Man, I could see this spinoff game being a holdover for whatever Halo Infinite 2 or the expansion for Halo Infinite's campaign DLC could be. And honestly, I think that's smart. I think stepping back, you know, we've had Mainline Chief for a long time now without a break. Halo Wars was sprinkled in there. But I think this would probably be a really good opportunity to really focus on the story aspect of the Mainline Halo franchise with Halo Infinite 2 or whatever it's going to be, or if it's just going to be an addition to Halo Infinite now. Having the spinoff game, you know, giving you a separate story and whatnot, I feel like would be just a smart idea. It gives you more time. It gets you another game out there. Hopefully it increases the quality of the expansion for the mainline games. And if it's good, it's going to sell. So then you have an influx of cash to allocate to other things. I would love an ODST too. I would love, you know, to be a Spartan going into the insurrectionist colonies or whatever before the Covenant War. I would love a horror game. Please give me that flood horror game. But there's something happening. And as always, I would love to know your opinions down in the comments down below. Is this being a clickbaity? Oh my God, this is hollow tide. He's clickbaiting. He's, geez, this isn't happening. This isn't real. We don't know. Or is this like actually something that's going to be substantial? Let me know in the comments down below. What spinoff game, if there is one, would you like to see? Like go to town, put your ideas down there. If you want a sword fighting elite St. Helios fighting game let me know but that's gonna do it for the video ladies and gentlemen if you enjoyed make sure you leave a like down below if you're new to the channel make sure you subscribe we're grinding away towards 15,000 subscribers we could hit it by the end of the year 90 percent of you don't follow or subscribe to this channel and i will catch you around the ring peace